What's up boys and girls? Uh, today's video we're starting a new build. This uh, one That's not very inclusive. Tana. Boys and girls. It's not a good way to open a video, man. Shut up. Do you know how much how many genders you're excluding there? <laughs> anyway, the we that's kinda right. They gonna for that one. <laughs> so we are building a one tana. So we've got here an HQ one tana, a little one eight six. Um, been a long time coming this build. Uh, we've got over one of these is a uh, little blue 308, uh, yellow terra head. Where did you want to take this off? <coughs> yellow terra headed 308, um, pretty cranky little 308, it's a good thing. Uh, turbo, turbo pattern, so we're doing uh, turbo 400 308 for this one, Tano. It's, uh, essentially, this is a build to sell to fund expansion of the property and other things. So, uh, we've been planning, as, as you guys would have seen in the background for a lot of our videos, we have heaps and heaps of old tunners. We've always been very partial to the one tunner. Uh, you know, Rex has got, we've got Raucous down there. We've got our nice yellow one that we built as well. Uh, we've always been one tunner people. So we have heaps of one tunners. The plan was to probably, we've got enough parts around to probably build three of them, like three good tunners to build and sell. Now that Holdens are sort of getting to that point where they're actually pulling pretty good money. So the plan is to build them, sell them to fund the extension of the shed uh, and the extension of the business and the expansion of the property and everything else. So we've already rebuilt the 308. Uh, like I said, this has been a long time coming. That 308 was rebuilt like probably two years ago now. Um, so it's done. We've got a turbo 400 there for it. Uh, as you can see, we're using this chassis. We're not using this cab. Uh, the cab we're using is out the back there. So dad's going to be ticking along with this while we sort of do our thing and we're just sort of be helping him here and there. So I figure I'll just follow some progress as we go because last time I talked about um, making footage of doing uh, the one ton of builds, uh, a lot of people were pretty keen on it. So we'll uh, turn this rusty bucket into a really, really nice car and hopefully get a little bit of money back. Mm, so we're going to actually just see if the 186 runs at the moment. Is nah, the plan? Oh, we're not. Nah, it's water pump's all fucked. I'm going to. It turns over fine, it will run, no problem. I just want to keep the shit out of the car, so all right. I'll set it on a run stand and run it later. Later on, all right. So pretty much at this point, yeah, we're just getting the cab off this chassis so that we can start with this chassis and Doug can start his, uh, uh, what do you call it, restoration. You gotta be careful with them, you don't twist it. So you don't see this much anymore, look how much room there is here. You pack up camp and start a little town in there. Turbos, you reckon? Yeah, maybe on a barrel. Not on a 186. What do you reckon? Barra the yellow one? Agadaga the yellow one? Also, it's actually HJ, not HQ. My mistake. Ah, uh, bit of weight reduction. Yeah, come up. Yeah. Oh, heaps yeah, of weight reduction there. There's no nuts, they screw into a, a keeper. Oh, yeah. So Plenty of weight reduction in this thing. Yeah, rust is lighter than carbon fiber. Absolutely. Hmm. Got this uh, X Force race exhaust. Oh, Only the best going on here. It's, it's even got uh, air shocks in it. Look at that. Got your little filler up here. Ooh, must have been the old milk truck. I thought that might happen. Rip the floor off. I'm not going to get it off. However, you've got to do it. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. I got the two on me. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> oh, no.
shaft out. Steering shaft? Yeah. Oh, no, it's going to come forward. Rusty carb gone. Then the chassis and running gear. Great thing about these old Holdens, they're very modular, there's not much to them. Anyway, this is what we start with. Pretty good chassis, it's, um, it's not too bad. That body was absolutely cooked, but the chassis is actually pretty good. So, try and get the 186 running, like Dad was saying. He'll put a new water pump on it and try and get it running. So, we can maybe try and advertise it for sale as a runner for someone who might want to rebuild it. Or if someone wants to buy it rebuilt, we can rebuild it for them. And uh, then rip it out and put the 308 and the Turbo 400 in and start building it up from there. It's actually the, the 308 that's going in it was actually originally the 308 out of the blue one. Once upon a time. Hmm. One many, of its very first iterations of life. Many moons ago. Many iterations ago of Raucous. Yeah, I better clean up all this crap. <laughs> so much shit. <laughs> all right, so we've got the chassis back out here, ready to go. That cab is just there for parts and stuff when we need it. This is the cab that we will be using, and this is pretty much the front end that's going on this cab, I believe. Um, we do have a lot of holder stuff. We'll use them seats and get interior retrimmed. We do have a full, like a real nice WB front cut as well. I'm pretty sure Dad's going to use uh, this front end, so. This is all here ready to start some panel work. As you can see, we've got a few repairs to do in this roof. But uh, overall, this cab's actually really good. Um, a really good cab, so that's gonna be the plan for the tunnel. Dad just wanted to, us to give him a hand to get that cab off so that he can start on that chassis while we're sort of working through the week in that. So Dad can chip away doing things. And we're gonna give him a hand every now and then, but uh, yeah, that's gonna be it for the, that's the start of the build pretty much. It's part one and we'll check in every now and then and continue filming the progress that happens because uh, a few people have said they're going to be interested it's going to be a fair, fairly long-term build um, obviously dad's retired and he just sort of does as much as he feels like every day so it's not going to be um, a mad mad hurry uh, but you know it's just a matter of getting it done this is the 308 is it yeah the 308 we're using so yeah a little pretty high comp yellow terra headed 308 it's pretty pretty good little 308 this thing so been rebuilt hmm very nice anyway guys that's gonna be it thanks for watching as always smash like smash subscribe peace out see you bye <laughs>